G'day, g'day, and welcome to the first ever SMG4 annual recap, and what a long year it has been, because if you look back, an entire year of SMG4 has flown by just like that, and as in, in this time, so much things has happened, not just in the show itself, but also the amazing community which came together along the way, and all the amazing stuff surrounding that. So today, I'd like to give us a moment to look back at the year and admire the things, not just SMG4, but us have done. I'll start off by giving you my little analyst slash review of the entire year. So without further ado, let's go. This year in 2023, two movies have been released. It's going to be perfect in Western Spaghetti and hell, you can even connect what by 2023 to this list because ho ho, it looks like SMG4 is attempting to do so much more of the channel than 2022 because I have no idea what most of 22 is was about. But I do know for a fact that SMG4 is starting to move away from Nintendo, most significantly because of the castle destruction in order to start making movies like Western Spaghetti. And we can't talk about SMG4 without talking about Glitch, because holy hell, when I said they are moving away from Nintendo, they really are. On October the 12th, Glitch uploaded the amazing Jewel Circus, and it skyrocketed. But back to SMG4, I'm gonna give this year, the year, a not bad 7 out of 10. Why? Well, it, it seems because most of the episodes are just filler episodes or hit or miss episodes. Which, it seems like the movies and stuff is what SMG4 is prioritising, and I can say, that is what made Western Spaghetti so good. The only problem I find is because the other, all the other episodes are mostly just filler. They can't really connect or continue off the movies, and that's basically a big problem with the SMG4 show right now. Long story short, SMG4 loves making movies now, and I truly hope SMG4 fixes that problem next year in 2024, because simply, I do not want SMG4 to get worse from here, and the movies kinda just don't really fit in and make the other episodes look like fit in a way, if you know what I mean. But let's not just talk about SMG4, let's talk about the fan base, the amazing things the fan base achieved this year. First of all, the Machinima artists, which I find to be the best part of the SMG4 fanbase, because they sort of delimit what the SMG4 world can do and make their own crazy animations, and that's what makes the fanbase so unique. It's not just SMG4, it's all the Machinima's, Machinima artists making cool animations as well. Not just that, but also the critics of SMG4, which include Fozzy79, you heard of him on Reddit, and TurboBist28, who are here because they want to make SMG4 better. And obviously, if the criticism doesn't get across the SMG4 team, then information is also shared around the fanbase to get more understanding, which is probably why I joined the SMG4 fanbase, to help out with that situation. And you can't talk about the fanbase without talking about the theorists, because boy, they just made the initial show even more exciting, as it shows what the fans will think will happen in the show. This is also of the reaction channels of SMG4, where we get to express, as fans, how we feel about the show. And like Matty Excalibur said in one of his videos, it is amazing for him to see all the reaction collabs and that, which is also what I think makes the SMG4 fanbase so unique is that we like seeing how the audience and the fans and fanatics have been reacting to the videos that we make. Nothing means the world to us than seeing how the scenes that we've created or come up with have ended up being able to entertain you or make you laugh.
Now this little section of the video, I'm going to go over all the people we met along the way in 2023 and also the ones who have supported and contributed this year to our amazing community. So if you see yourself, feel free to express yourself in the comments. And with that everyone, that brings us to the end of the annual recap. And I think I'm just here to say thank you, everyone, for making 2023 for SMT4 such a good year. See, not everything has to be just about the show, because with us, we can create animations, theories, and much more. And that's why I think we all have been sticking around to this community. So my wish is, keep this community thriving, and have a happy new year.